o'clock. Now, it's not long to go before we go up right up your street in Middleton in Greater Manchester. Tonight, the friendly people of Armitage Close in Rhodes have put out the red carpet for us. That's all in a few minutes. But first, let's find out why they thought we should pay them a visit. <laughs> Welcome to Armitage Club. Well, we're all really like living here. We're all very friendly. Everybody helps each other out. Uh, we know we can call on any neighbour at any time and uh, they'll always be willing to help. The neighbours are really friendly and nice. They really get on with one another, look after each other's children as well. In fact, some of the neighbours are uh, relatives because the first person that moved on told the brother and sister that the, the, the houses were so nice and the street was so welcoming and warm that they've now moved on. So we've got two, three generations of the same family living on the close. We all look after one another's children. It's like um, a crash because we were at various altering times so that at any one given time there are mothers on the street that will take care of the other mother's children. So it's nice in that respect that the children will looked after and cared for on the estate and we know that they're safe when others' mothers have to go out to work. A lot of people have turned off over the years and they're not used to um, being community spirited because it's all fallen away but to build it up takes effort and you need people to pull together and put that effort in to be in a community and that's what we achieved at Armitage Club. I think, I think if you asked anybody that lived here um, what would be the first thing they'd do with uh, a lottery win? Most people would say move house. Nobody here would say that. No. They all want to stay here. That's right. We've all got children and they need to be looked after. They need to be taught that to care for people is good and it comes back to you. And that's why I want my children to have a happy environment, to grow up in a happy, carefree environment and off the close. They can't have that. They can't go from the close with freedom. They, they're not free anymore, but on the close they are. Now for the past week it's been the most pampered piece of